Welcome to uh, Wispapalooza 2016. Um, I'm speaking with John of uh, Viewbic Networks. John, tell us a little bit about Viewbic. Okay, uh, Viewbic Networks, we focus on point-to-point -point millimeter wave uh, Ethernet links. Uh, this is our second year. We were at Wispalooza last year, and we're here this year. Last year we announced our Hall Pass V60, which is a full gig, full duplex solution. And this year we're announcing, we're very happy to announce our new 10 gig solution. It's called the Hall Pass V10G. Um, this, this time around we have got the V60 that is uh, one gig full duplex for $4,000. And this is a special for this show. And for the 10 gig we are producing pre-orders for $79.95. That's quite reasonable for that price. You've got other vendors that aren't doing nearly 10 gig for, no, we're, for, we are for 8,000. the first company that is providing a, a WISP solution in uh, 10 gig. And, yeah. uh, f all plumbed for, for every option. We've got two fibers, we've got two coppers. We also have redundant power with the 48 volt. So uh, all in okay. one nice small uh, enclosure and the antenna is already attached in there. So uh, there's nothing else in a WISP needs to light up a building with 10 gig. Sure. It, uh, then uh, in some of your advertisements, I've seen how you talked about you know two by you know one and a quarter or ten gig. Yeah. Um, but I've seen product, you know some of the other ten gig products I've seen in the past. They've been really basic. Like either you get the full ten gig or you don't get jack. Yeah. Well, we, that's a really good question. And and yes, there's a specific way that we've designed this product, and it was all based on customer feedback. So. Uh, the coppers have a switch inside the radio, so they actually go through uh, a gigabit switch. Um, but the fiber, our customers wanted basically a pass-through, so this is a direct fiber to radio connection. So okay. there's absolutely no latency loss in this, and uh, it's what our customers wanted. So when you want to get a 10, full 10 gigs out of this radio, you'll connect directly to SFP+, Plus, okay. and uh, it'll be a straight shot, just like a wire. In fact, the only thing the, the, you'll see on the radio is the MAC address. Okay. But if you go through one of our uh, ports that go through our switch, uh, you'll have the benefit of a full carrier grade switch, uh, SNMP, uh, spanning tree, VLAN, all that good stuff and that would be utilized through the two and a half gig side. So okay. uh, there's actually two products in one, and the reason we did it, number one, was because that's what our customers wanted, and number two, it allows the WISH to evolve. So if they don't have fiber to the rooftop, they can go ahead and connect on via carp copper, and when they do get the fiber up, they can take uh, advantage of the SPF Plus. Okay, At, uh, uh, so then, then uh, you know, on your 10 gig, you know, what are we looking at for, you know, I always hate when people ask this question about you know range because obviously range depends upon a million factors. But yeah. but you know as we've seen with some of the other products, um, you know the you know sweet spot for them is you know really in the you know six seven eight hundred meter area. Yeah, for ten gig it's about eight hundred meters. Okay. Uh, but our maximum is one point eight kilometers. Okay. And our minimum is fifty meters. Okay. Uh, the sweet spot, as you say, uh, for ten gig is about eight hundred meters. Okay. Okay. And, and we have automatic gear shifting, we have adaptive modulation, everything inside this. Uh, okay, okay, yeah. Because <laughs> uh, on some of the other 10 gigs I saw, it was just, you did full 10 gig or the link was down. And so it's nice having that, uh, you know, yeah. modulation uh, yeah. you, drop. You, you might have seen over here that we have, we go all the way down to okay. about 400 meg. So okay. uh, rain phase is not a problem as well. Okay, good, uh, uh, good deal. And uh, as uh, many in the WISP industry know, I'm a big supporter of SFP interfaces, and so it's it's nice to see those available, and especially SFP Plus. That's right. That's right. Um, now, uh, as far as management of the radio, um, is that only something we could get if we're do using the you know two and one and a quarters? Or that's right. Using, that's oh, okay. right. So you'll either well, this this fiber uh, connection here actually goes through the switch as well. So you could use fiber, okay. or you could use copper. Okay. And, but that is how you get to the switch, and that's where all the management software is. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Um, if one were to do a 10 gig, could they plug in the other one for absolutely, management? Absolutely. Okay. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, because you know, as you mentioned, you know, all you see is the MAC address. It's kind of concerned. Oh, so we 
we turn it on and then yeah. and nothing, you know, well, the link works, but we don't know what it's doing. Yeah, the theory is, is that if you're going to invest in a 10 gig radio, go rooftop for rooftop, sure. you're going to have a 10 gig switch on the premise. Oh, sure, so sure. So why yeah. have two? How, why have the redundancy? So oh, sure, yeah. We followed what our customers were looking for. Yeah, it's, uh, yeah you know, it's nice to have that and then have the option to do, you know, fiber or copper That's right. on the management. That's right. That's uh, right. It, you know, having that separate power also was nice because, you, know, uh, you know, I'm a fan of, uh, you know, I don't, I want complete electrical isolation between my outdoor equipment and my indoor equipment. Especially for lightning, yes. Yeah, because uh, if there's no electrical path, I can't blow up anything. We did everything we could to make sure the plumbing is for every option. Sure. Every yeah, option. It, uh, yeah. It's, it's great, it's great. And, um, and, uh, you said that it does about, uh, about $8,000 for the link, you said? Yeah, we have a, a special going on right okay. now. Uh, these units will be available shipping, hopefully, by the end of the year. We okay. are, we're working very hard for that goal. Uh, but for the show uh, attendees, uh, we're offering these at seventy nine ninety five dollars apiece. Okay. Um, I see on your one up on your little demo tower that you've got a, uh, a little scope accessory on there. Uh, this comes with it. Oh, so, uh, okay. So for rough alignment. In addition to that, after rough alignment, we have these LEDs in the back of the unit that'll actually tell you how good you're doing as far as alignment. Okay. So very easy to align. Okay. Non-telco installer could definitely install and align this. Okay. At, uh, I'm liking everything I see here. Um, Thank you. I appreciate that. And uh, thank you for spending a few minutes with us today. No problem at all. Thank you.